the differences between PG-1200 and PG-1400 fall into three basic categories. Two of the differences, tool size and magnification range, are pretty simple. Encoders are a little bit more complex, but they are very significant. Let's look at the simple ones first. There are differences in the tool size that each unit can accommodate. The PG-1400 can accommodate tools up to 3 inches in diameter. The PG-1200 can inspect tools up to 1 inch in diameter. The difference in capacity is caused by a difference in design. The 400 models have a microscope assembly that is mounted horizontally on a linear bearing and controlled by a hand wheel. This additional travel allows the 400 to have a larger focal range. That's why it can handle tools up to 3 inches in diameter. The PG-1200 microscope assembly is fixed. That helps it to reduce cost, but it also limits the focal range. The 200 and the 400 have differences in the level and range of magnification they can achieve. The 400 offers us 14 magnification levels. The more detents in a microscope means more options that the user has for imaging. The PG-1200 has seven magnification levels. In terms of range, PG-1400 offers 12.5x to 145x, while PG-1200 offers 15x to 95x. The 400 also offers optional levels of magnification utilized in inspecting large or micro tools. Unlike the 200, the 400 has built-in encoders which automatically report, record, and display measurement data directly to the system software. In addition to X and Y parameters, the 400 acquires magnification data, the angle of tool rotation, and focus data. First of all, the M axis. The 400 has a magnetic encoder which will automatically synchronize the scope magnification with the software. PG-1200 doesn't have that encoder, so scope magnification in the software must be manually switched by the user to match the physical magnification of the microscope. 400 models have an A-axis encoder. This is a magnetic encoder which reads and displays the position of the pivoting base block of the 400 in degrees and minutes and gives that information to the software, which allows it to be reflected on reports. This feature allows the user to be more consistent when setting up for repeat tool inspections. PG-1200 doesn't have an encoder for the base block, so base block position is therefore not displayed on the software or on reports. Instead, a protractor decal and a manual index plunger with fixed locations at minus 90 degrees, 0 degrees, and 90 degrees is provided for location reference. PG-1400 models have an F-axis encoder on the focus assembly of the microscope. This encoder allows the software to display a blue reference bar that represents the center line of a tool. Just move the red focus bar to the blue line and you're quickly focused on the center line of the tool. The ability to save focus settings also allows the user to be more consistent when setting up repeat tool inspections. PG-1200 doesn't include an encoder for the focus, so focus location must be manually interpreted by the user. In addition to differences in tool size, magnification level, and encoder count, there are a few variations on the PG-1400 which allow for specialty applications. There's a PG-1400 LT with a larger granite base and taller column that allows larger tool inspections up to 5 inches in diameter or up to 13.4 inches long. The standard 400 will measure tools up to 3 inches in diameter or up to 7.5 inches long. The PG-1000 1.0X option offers 25 to 290 times magnification, allowing you to inspect small tools between 25 thousandths of an inch and 4 tenths of an inch in diameter. There's also a PG-1000 1.3X option with 35X to 415X magnification for micro tools between 15 thousandths and 3 tenths of an inch diameter. No matter which of the options you choose, you'll receive the following standard accessories. A PG-1000 gauge, a pivoting base block for tool holding fixtures, 
a 5-inch V-block assembly which includes a notched V-block insert, a top or tool clamp, and a carbide-tipped backstop. You'll also receive a variable intensity 18-inch gooseneck LED work light with a diffuser cap. You'll get a magnetic white diffuser plate, a high-performance PC, a 4K Ultra HD monitor, and reaction software with free upgrades for life depending upon your hardware. In addition to standard features, there are many common accessories available for the 200 or the 400. In terms of lighting, there's a ring light, a backlight, an illumination tube, and a light diffuser tube. There are concentricity fixtures, center fixtures, gun drill fixtures, longer V-blocks or specialty V-block inserts, calibration reticles, and even a customized PC workbench. If you have any questions about which PG-1000 product is right for you, feel free to contact us. We will be glad to help.